When you finish your job, you'll get twice as much. But you have to do it right away. Tonight. And it should look like an accident. That's too soon. We can't do it in one day. We have to prepare first. You're a professional. I have a reliable plan. Today is a good moment to execute that plan. Or I have to improvise. Write this down. This is my new number so we can communicate. such a horrible person to represent our interests. No. no. We'll spare no efforts to make sure that this whore won't be deciding our fate. We shall drive her away. Right, listen. Let her betray her husband, but not the people. Good afternoon. You have 15 minutes for an interview. Please formulate the questions clearly and to the point. We're ready. Let's start. Good afternoon, my name is Denis Dobrovolsky. I'm the general director of Cherkasi Silicat Bud. I understand that you have a lot of questions about recent events that took place here. I'm here to answer them all. Uh, Denis Dobrovolsky, I'm Leonid Piskun from the new channel. Please tell us whether your family is looking for the person who uploaded the controversial video on the internet. And who's there on the video, in your honest opinion? Yes, we're looking for the person who had uploaded the video. We're conducting an investigation right now. As soon as we get the conclusions of the experts, we'll inform the public. Please, comment on how your family reacted after seeing the sensational video that was no exposed. No comments. But people are starting to gossip already. There's loads of fake news going around. What are you going to do about that? It's not prohibited to express opinions. It's a right for every individual. I'd like to tell you one thing. The person who had uploaded the video wanted a scandal. He or she got it. Stay at home. I'll come over soon. I'll bring the evidence that my sister is lying to you. It can't be true. I don't believe you. Yes, Andri. I beg you not to ignore me anymore. I can't live like this. Please come by. I beg you. Andri, we've talked about this. Do you really hate me that much? I don't see any reason why we should continue this talk. Goodbye. I think it's a question after we find out. In a couple of days, we'll know the whole truth. So, uh, my good. family is dealing with this situation He's holding as well. rationally as we He's can. He's very calm, right? It is very difficult. So we request it's good that, that Dennis decided to deliver a speech. Us. I hope the media now calms down. And the activists? Oh no, they won't stop in an instant. It's the politics. Possible. I'm ending this interview. I hope I have answered all your questions. Thank you, everyone. Dennis did very well. Mm hmm He is so clear and concrete. As it should be. It'll all go back to normal now. 
Soon people will forget about this scandal. Yes, for sure. Him? Yes. Maybe this will help. Girls, aren't you all gonna go home soon? It's already late. It's all right. We have to complete our work. Hand these papers over to Dennis to be signed tomorrow, mm -hmm. okay? Thank you. Go home. I understand that your day has been really stressful. Did you see them? Did the activists leave? Uh, I think they did. This is good. I hope they will finally calm down after this press conference. How is Anna holding on? I don't know. Okay, we're good. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Bye -bye. We got it ready. Come in, switch the light on, and it's all done. Super. Stay in touch. What happened? Why couldn't you talk with me over the telephone? I didn't want to risk anything, in case the phones are tapped. You shall immediately withdraw from your political campaign. What? Why? The mood of the audience didn't change. They don't want to see you right now in the council meeting. I hope that after your husband's press conference it will all get better. But it didn't make an impact. He talked about the wrong person too. He ignored his wife and not the stranger whom he doesn't actually know. We cannot stop the media. Unless he believes in you. It's you who should believe in me. I'll bring you the million you need me, remember? Our ratings are falling quick. The employees of the party's office are forced to deal with loads of complaints from the audience. The people are mad because we are all still supporting you. It's not just you who can't sleep at night. You know damn well that I am the victim of somebody's dirty game, and I can't do anything about it. Only serious counterpoints could save the situation. Like what? The only thing that may save you is a confession. A sudden confession of a person who had faked that bloody video. If she or he made a public statement, then the audience would take your side. Our people will sympathize with the underdog. There's no question about that. It'll work. In that case, the scandal can only do us good. It is good PR. But how can we find a person would set you up and make him confess. Give me some time, okay? I'll call you back. Cancel your mission. I don't care how. Do whatever you want, but Yana should survive. Yes, you may keep the advance that's yours. This is it. We have to go back. She just canceled. 
Andrew has to survive. I hope there's more time. God damn it! Andri! Wake up, do you hear me? Come on, wake up. God, you almost died. What have you done? Uh, what is... Uh, what is happening? Oh, <coughs> oh no. <laughs> what is... <coughs> oh, God. <sighs> God, you're such oh. a fool. <coughs> Are they alive? Did you see them? Okay. I'll think about it. Right. The only thing left to do now is... to talk my sister into a public confession that she faked everything and uploaded that video. Anna. Read it. What is it? I don't remember. You're drinking too much already. What did you want to prove? Who is this for? Anna. Why did you break the window? I... You did a right thing, though. Anna. Otherwise, you'd be dead already. Promise. I promise I'll quit, I swear. I promise. I'm sorry. Please. <clears throat> I... Oh, I'm sorry. I worried about you. Did you notice that after the press conference, the journalists stopped calling our house? Hmm. I told you we should talk to the public. It's good that Dennis listened to me. Good morning. Good morning. The media's good for now. And then we'll see after. Mm, I'm on time. You haven't eaten yet. Good morning, honey. I'll just call your father. Oh, I was just about to call you. I just overslept a bit. Barely could get up from my bed. It's because it was quiet outside. There are no activists today. Maybe they calm down. Hopefully for good. They will come later. I will expect less. We'll still hear them shouting. Here's your order. Thank Please you. Please come again soon. Bon appetit. Good afternoon. We're happy to welcome you to our new studio. The main news of the day are the following. New facts uncovered. In the case of the scandalous video involving Anna Dobrovolsky and two witnesses a few days ago. Are you stating that recently Anna Dobrovolsky tried to seduce you? Uh-huh, yes. She definitely did, and she wanted to get some money out of us. Kolya and I were having fun in the club, and she was heavily made up and telling us that she was very cool and ready for anything. Huh? Right? She sat on his lap flirting with him. And I can tell she was ready to have fun. We tried Please shaking turn her that off, TV but she off. didn't. Olya, don't take it seriously yet. Did you see their faces? Those guys will do anything for a bottle. I recognized that bastard with a microphone right away. 
He's that journalist that didn't want to drink my coffee with mustard. That's why he's vindictive. Why did you turn the TV off? Can I watch it again? The news is interesting. Interesting news, you say? How about I pull your arms off now and say that it was like that before? That'll <gasps> be interesting. How dare you touch second. my stuff? When will you stop coming here? When? When will you leave us alone? <sighs> I can see it clearly now. With a family like this, it's hard to grow up like a normal person. Mm -hmm. I'll definitely write in my article that this restaurant is an example of bad dining and treatment of the customers. I'm leaving. Goodbye. Mm -hmm. Bon appetit. It all starts from you and me. We can't let an immoral person come to power. Did you forget what was happening to our country just a couple of years ago? We have to learn from mistakes. We will Hello. not tolerate any How type of scandal. How are you doing? Scandal. It's all under control. There's no provocation so far. That's great. There's a lot of idiots. How am I going to get to talk with my sister? What are you doing? What are you doing here? Your place is in the whorehouse, not in the city council. Withdraw your candidacy. Shame on you! Shame! 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 Are you finally happy now? This is all your fault. Why did you have to film me seducing you? Everything would have been fine without it. Will you keep your voice down? You're being watched. I'm begging you, Andre. You used to love me. I can help you with this. You should talk Yana into saying that this video is a setup and planned. Why would I tell Yana to lie? She wouldn't. It's for your sake at least. Somebody might find out that it was you on that video. She wouldn't want to set you up with that. Don't pretend that you're a saint. You have been lying to her for such a long time. It's your time for redemption. Andre. I'll owe you everything if you talk to Yana. It's the activists. Please don't let her go on her own. Ever. Andre helped me. Pass through. Okay, I'm going. Why did you come here? I wanted to talk to you. Can't we talk at home? Where? In front of your relatives? I wanted to talk to you alone, but you're avoiding me. Why did you lock up in the guest room? I was knocking. I was sleeping. What did you want to talk about? I wanted to tell you about my plans on my pre-election campaign. Vitovsky said that under certain circumstances, the scandal with a video may... may do good for us. It was your idea joining the election. I wasn't supporting you. But I agreed to postpone the divorce so that you could fix yourself. As soon as the situation changed, you may sign the papers now, and we'll separate. I'll talk to my lawyers, and they will prepare the papers needed for the divorce. You can't expect me to sign those papers. I still love you. I've had enough of your lies. Your love is nothing but a sham, Anna. Listen, the video is fake. I was always faithful to you. You'll see it when it gets sorted out. And when the stories are straight, you'll be ashamed for not trusting me. Don't you realize that my competitors did it? Because of them, I can lose both my beloved man and the opportunity to win city council. The city council and I have the same impression of you. That's not true. Listen to my advice. You better withdraw from the elections. It's the best thing you can do right now. I can't do that. I can't surrender. It'll be suspicious. We're attracting unwanted attention. You should go. Let me help you through the crowd. Anna, what 
are you going to do in this situation you're now facing? Let us go, please. Hello? Rihori Markovich? It's me. Dennis walked your daughter-in-law to her car. Mm-hmm. Okay. The employee saw Anna by the office. What did she want? She was trying to convince me that the video was fake. What if she's right? I was thinking that maybe we should ask Vadim to help us prove that. He proved himself that we can trust him. I don't think it's necessary, plus videos are not his forte. It's not about the video. I was talking about watching Anna. If she is innocent, then good for her. If not, then maybe... What? I've already tried watching her moves. I hired a private detective to find out whether there was any connection between Anna, Yana, and her sister's boyfriend. Nothing was confirmed, but I really feel bad about it. I don't want to watch her ever again. No more detectives. Did you suspect that something was going on? Between Anna and Andri? Sometimes I have a feeling that... Maybe it's Andri Popovich. It's the one on that video. But why would he film her doing such things? It's utter nonsense. Maybe I should tell my brother about what happened in Andri's apartment when Andri called Anna. But Andri said that there was nothing between them. He was telling the truth, I could see it. Why pour more gas on the fire? Good afternoon. Anna. Hello. Come here. Andri, why did you come here? I asked you to go to the hospital. Calm down. I'm perfectly doing fine. Look at me. It's good that you worry for me. I'm very pleased. Very funny. I thought it was something important. What did you call me for? Listen to me. I spoke to your sister and she wanted you to publicly confess that the uploaded video is a fake one. And you set it up. No. No, that will never happen. This conversation is over. Now please don't distract me from work. Anna. <sighs> Listen to me. After yesterday, I had a long reflection about life. Long story short, I decided to start a new life. That's very good. Yes, I know. It's good for me. Currently, the windows are being replaced in my apartment. I hired the cleaners to clean my bachelor's pad, and... I made us your favorite dinner. Anna? Anna? Will you come to my place tonight? Andri, excuse me. But I really need to go find my own apartment to stay in. Do you get it? I need to be alone for some time, all right? But do you still drink? I don't. You promise? I promise I won't. This is it. Bye. Karolina. Rehorivna. Andri. I... I feel really well today. I don't drink anymore, especially at work. I'm ready to work. I'm ready to come back. I'm... I really need it. Get to work then. Thank you. Good day. We shall hold on until the end of the election. We won't leave until we hear the answers. Our questions will be answered whether they like it or not. We'll make them respect the people's authority. Yes, let them answer. They won't drive us away. Hey, I'll help you get through. Just stay close to me. Shame, 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 sh
Excuse me, excuse me. Be careful, excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me. Wait for me here. Friends? Friends, I understand that you're worried about some other things at the moment since all of you are here. I have interesting information to share with you all. If you're planning to build a house or repair stuff in the future, then know this. The products of the Cherkasi silicate boot are the best not only in Ukraine, but maybe even in Europe. Then what for? What for? To pour dirt at the owners of the company that produced eco tiles for all of us? Did you know that? Well, did you? At the Spring Building Forum in Lviv this year, the new products of the Cherkasi Siligat boot were announced to have the most potential for development. And it's not in vain, because they are very passionate. Who wants to see the samples? I have the newest catalog here. Anyone? We don't need that. Here you go. Here you go. Be more brave. Come on. Guys, is anybody here listening? Here you go. Who else? Come on. Here you go. Come on. Here you go. Good afternoon. I'm calling for the apartment. Oh, it's already occupied. Problems at home? Oh, no. My aunt's husband came, and it became a bit too tight. Plus, it's time for me to live on my own. If you want, you can stay with me. I have lots of space, and it'll be fun until you find an apartment for good. Really? Yes. It'll be just for tonight. I'll call them. I'll rearrange the schedule in. Excuse me. Hello. Are you busy now? Hmm. Look, I... I really need to talk to you. I'm busy right now. This is important. Hmm? For whom? Andri told me about your request. My answer is no. This isn't about Andri. I just want to talk to you personally. This won't take a very long time, I promise you that. Is it so difficult for you to meet me? Anna, I beg you, just listen and I'll leave you alone. <sighs> Where are you now? I'll be back in a bit, okay? Mm hmm <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Tell me what you want. Please forgive me. I understand that nothing can change what happened. I... I... I have no idea what was happening that time. I didn't want it to be this way. <laughs> if only I could change the past. <laughs> I've heard that from you before. You don't believe me? You don't believe me, do you? You're angry at me. <laughs> yes, you have every right. <laughs> but we're sisters. Just think about mom. She will suffer from this. <laughs> when everybody finds out what you've done to me, you'll... You'll be headed to prison. Every morning when I wake up, I look into the mirror and I'm forced to see your face. I used to love it because it's my sister's face. But now I hate it. Anna. Forgive me, I'm begging you. I, I... I... I didn't realize what I was doing. But I'm realizing it now. And I regret everything I did. I am begging you. Have mercy on me. Save me. If you have the slightest mercy on my soul. <laughs> I... I regret it, you hear me? Who did I turn into? Anna, I regret it! 
how can I be better than my sister if I wanted to destroy her, to see Yana ruined and humiliated? Is that what I really want in life? I feel so shallow. No, revenge is a sign of weakness and the devil's work. But I swear, no matter what happens to me from now on, I'll be kind. Whatever they'll do to me, I'll still be like who I was before. I shouldn't care. I may have lost my face and my body, but I, I won't lose myself anymore. Thank God there are no journalists by our house today. God, I'm so tired of all this nightmare already. It's all right. It'll end soon. You'll see. You better tell me what we'll have for dinner. Shall I boil potatoes with salted fish and some salad? Okay. Why cook when we have everything? What's in here? How much more of those dumplings can we eat? I want some more fish sticks and salted cucumbers. Are you pregnant? Hm. I wish I were. <laughs> Hello. No, no, I'm almost ready. I'll go and change right now, all right? <laughs> I wanted to console that fool, but I can see she already made up with Danilo. <laughs> oh. Yana, honey, is that you? Good evening. Hello. What's going on with her? Yes. What else do we need to take? Play-doh, constructing blocks, and eco-tiles? We need something special to present them. What about buying something for handmade classes instead? We can buy a simple cross-stitch, patterns, and yarn for the girls to work on. I think they will like that. Very good. Mm. Very good. Mm. That's a great idea. Why haven't I thought of that? Put it down, Valeria. Things for cross-stitching, and I can teach them, mm -hmm. too. Hi, everybody. Did you see it's finally calm out there? There's no more protesters outside the house. They've just left. It's all right. It's just a question of time. Today or tomorrow, it will all be sorted out, and they will stop terrorizing us. Sweets and cookies. Lots of sweets. Let the children enjoy them. Sweets. Mm. Are you going to the orphanage this week? Sweets. Can I please go with you? Do you really want to show your face? Our prime candidate is worried for the fate of the orphans. Mom. What, Mum? She doesn't care about the kids. The main thing for her is her PR. You're wrong. Did you hear what you were told? Starting from today, you are not allowed to join in any activities that we will do as a family. Valeria, Jana. Let's just go. You can cheat and scam anybody, but not me. I can see right through you. There won't be any more excuses. Or any redemption. Your days in this house are numbered and limited. As soon as I find out the truth of what happened, It will be better for you to pack your things and leave now. How are you doing, Dimitro? I, uh, I was just going to call you. No, no, everything's under control. Hmm. Anna, are you really going to leave for good? Anna? I thought I was Yana for you again, am I not? It's because Luba and Petra were there. Oh, of course. Just tell me where you're going to stay at Andres. No. 
at my colleagues. Do you... Do you hate me so much that you're ready to go to a stranger's house? Rather than staying with me under one roof? No, I just decided to rent an apartment while I still have such an opportunity. I turned to the real estate agency way before. I paid them to guide me. Find a place. Then wait for them to find you a place. Daughter, please. There were problems in the restaurant again. What happened? Those bloody journalists are always digging for problems all day long. The activists lost their shame too. I wish you saw what they had done to our walls. I felt ashamed to go outside. Everybody was pointing fingers. Hey, there's the mother of the lady who... I never thought I'd live long enough to hear those words. I wanted you guys to grow as a good model. No, Mom, it's not your fault we're like this. I'm guilty because I wanted to destroy my sister's life. I wanted to have my revenge, but because of my anger, so many people are suffering right now. This is not what I wanted. Mom, all. Please don't worry. I'll stay here. I'll be here. <laughs> Even if Dennis forgives me, I know his father won't. He'll do anything. And I mean anything to get rid of me. What should I do now? No. I didn't get this chance for nothing. I saw that head on. But the trouble keeps on coming too. It just can't end simply like this. Mom, is Yana home? Yes, your sister is at home. What do you want from her? Nothing at all from her. All I need is you. I want to talk, but just one-on-one. -on -one. Where can we do it tonight? Why do you even need your mother if you never listen to me? I told you my opinion about politics, and you didn't listen until you were in trouble. When are you going to grow up and take responsibility for your actions for once? Mom, please, this is not a joke. I want to tell you something important. It's an issue of life and death. I swear I'm not lying. I'll be in the restaurant in about half an hour. Dan, can you forgive me? I found out that she was your mother by accident. Lada made me swear that I wouldn't tell anybody, especially you. What would you do if you were in my shoes? It's okay. I'm not angry at you. Really? Yes. You know, your mother is really nice. Yes, she abandoned you when you were a child. Unforgivable, yes, but she was looking for you everywhere. Did she tell you about it? Yes. Dan, please listen. Your mom is still alive. You hear me? My mom is dead, and no one can change that. Be glad that... You can still talk to her. 
You can look at her. You can take her hand. I beg you. Forgive her. Maybe I could do it for you. But she already left, and I don't know where she is. Are you out of your mind, Anna? What confession in front of the reporters? Mom, please listen. You should convince Yana to do it, please. Tell her to announce a press conference and confess that the video was fake. How can you be so selfish? Do you want your sister to sacrifice herself for you? Mama, I'll pay her well when I win at the elections. I won't ask anybody to do anything for anyone. Do you know that she was the one who uploaded that video, if not for your beloved daughter? But it's you on the video. It doesn't make any difference either way. Of course I'm not the one in the video. Just tell her. You're the only person she'll listen to. Anna won't listen to me. What is wrong with you? When did you start mixing up our names? I know that it's you and Andri. I'm not mixing up anything, Yana. I know everything. You're crazy. Get back and sit down! How could you do that to your sister? How dare you fool our family for your own reasons? Hello, come in. Mm-hmm. Sit down. Thank you. Have you determined who was on that video? Not yet, but the experts have almost finished. They need a day. Why does it take so long? Okay, what about my daughter-in-law? I've been watching her move all day. First she went back to the office, then after, she met with her sister in the park. Just with her sister? There was nobody else there. Then she drove along the Kiev Road, along the Countryside Road. Where is it, exactly? She stopped at the 48th kilometer point by the gasoline station. That is all we know. It's where the crash happened. That's weird. What? Go on, go on. I thought that she had to meet somebody there, but she simply stood by. She made a phone call and she drove back to the city. She's now, uh, talking to her mother in the restaurant. I see. What happened, happened. You can't undo what I did. We can, however, save the future. If Anna doesn't confess about the video, I won't just be kicked out from the campaign. Dennis will divorce me too. My father-in-law will find out too. I'll end up in jail. Is that what you want, Mom? <sighs> But I know another option. This is my last and final option. I would rather die than go and rot in jail.